Hi, I'm Aaron with the Selco Help Desk. Today I'll be showing you how to power cycle your internet modem. There are many different reasons why you need to power cycle an internet modem, but most of them stem from your lack of internet connection. Uh, this can be caused by memory leaks, short circuits, or overheating. So what we're going to want to do to power cycle the modem is locate your modem in the home. This is normally located near your wireless router or computer. Uh, if it's a phone modem, sometimes you can find it in the basement. You're going to want to locate the modem and then turn the modem around. On the back of the modem, the power cord is typically going to be a black, small, circular power cable, and you're just going to want to pull it right out, nice and easy. When you do that, all of the lights on the front of the modem will shut off. Wait about 30 seconds and then plug that back in and then give the modem about a minute to reboot. That'll allow enough time for the modem to reset itself and clear any errors that may have been occurring. In addition to your internet modem, we also have phone MTA modems. This runs your internet and phone for those customers who have phone service with us. The only exception to the MTA modems is in addition to the power cord that you have to pull out, you also have to locate the battery backup because these modems will work if you lose power. Open the case for the battery backup, the battery will be included here, and pull it out. If you have any problems with this process, you can certainly give us a call at the help desk at 508-841-8572.